Sports Line. Boise State came into an early morning matchup against Utah State with a chip on their shoulder. The Broncos walk out of Logan with a dominating 27-3 win. Utah State fans filled up the student section for the 10 in the morning game. The Aggies came into this matchup 3-0 for the first time since 1978. Boise State's defense was solid the entire game. They forced the Aggies to commit three turnovers. Tyreek LaBeouf picks off Logan Bonner's pass in the corner of the end zone. Boise State held Utah State scoreless throughout the first half. The Broncos scored their first touchdown of the day on the ground. Andrew Van Buren gets the rock and powers his way across the goal line. He only had two carries in this ball game, but made each of them count. Hank Bachmeyer went to work in the second half. He finished with 287 yards passing and two touchdowns. Khalil Shakir makes the catch by the pylon. Hank said his favorite touchdown of the day came late in the fourth quarter. He found defensive lineman Scott Matlock wide open in the end zone. The Broncos go on to beat Utah State 27-3. Head coach Andy Avalos says it was nice to get back on track with a win in their conference opener. You know, we're talking about mentality. We're starting to see it, you know. We're starting to see mentality starts with how we respond. That's football. And, um, again, it starts with our week of prep and, and how we build that through the course of the week, how we build the confidence to play a certain way. And when things don't go right, you know, that we stay in the fight. We understand. We, um, we talk about the adjustments that we need to make so that we can, uh, you know, adapt, overcome, and achieve. And, and the guys did an unbelievable job. Yeah, you know, I think uh... – that game, that was a grinder kind of game. It was a tough game, you know, even, you know, 27 to three, it was, it was a lot tougher than 27 to three. Great job, um, bring some some different pressures. But as far as the game plan, you know, I just think uh, Coach Plow was just thinking of creative ways to run the ball and just kind of get it going. So um, credit to him. The Broncos return back to the blue next week to host a tough Nevada team. Meanwhile, Utah State will host BYU on Friday night at Maverick Stadium. In Logan, I'm Adrian Luevano.